With just a minute, this is Christopher Walsh for Bama Central. Thanks for being here. The news that Villanova head coach in basketball, Jay Wright, has stepped down has really shook the sports world. It caught a lot of people by surprise. And look, I, I don't know why he is stepping down at age 60, walking away from coaching. But, you know, we keep hearing these coaches talking about how the recruiting landscape or the landscape in general has become like the wild, wild west and that there are no rules really governing what's going on anymore when it comes to transfers, when it comes to trying to lure uh, prospects, players to their school through basically money, you know, um, just pay for players. And it's incredibly frustrating. I mean, the coaches that we're talking to behind the, behind the scenes are saying that uh, they're frustrated um, and, and worse a lot, you know, they're using terms like fed up and, uh, it's just not a good scene right now. And so when you see a coach like Wright, who has a very strong reputation, walk away after taking a team to the final four, it doesn't take too much imagination to say that one might be related to the other. And even if, if, if they're not, you have to be really concerned about the, number of high profile coaches who are suddenly walking away. Uh, Coach K, uh, Roy Williams a year ago. Uh, now granted, Alon Kruger was um, getting up there in age, but he stepped away as well. And this is probably gonna be a growing trend that we see moving forward until the NCAA or another entity that might come along, which at this point you can't rule anything out, um, does something to curtail some of the lawlessness and make it so there are some some rules basically that are governing all this. And, and an obvious solution seems to be, you know, when a player signs a contract, they have to stay at that school for a certain amount of time. But the thing is, the smaller schools that are using this to try to close the gap with the bigger schools aren't going to want to go for it. So it's a, it's a huge problem. And it's one that's not going to be going away. And so when we see a coach who is highly respected walk away, it just makes me wonder this is just the beginning, not the end.